So yesterday I had decided to stream on Twitch uh, Tower of Fantasy for the first time because I'd never played it. And, you know, it was it was fine for what it was. Um, I wouldn't necessarily say that I would have gone back to continue playing it live, at least consistently. But it was a decent game in the grand scheme of things. Uh, I had some criticisms, like, about the character creation and how there weren't really a lot of, you know, black uh, options, like, with hairstyles and everything. But, um, I did, you know, for what it was, I didn't really matter or mind it too much in the grand scheme of things. But then just earlier today, I decided, you know what, I'm going to create a new character. So I jumped in a new server. I decided to create a new version of my character and just sort of like go through that cre character creation process again. And I realized something. And it's something that while it might be minute, it might be maybe even a bit of a nitpick to some people. It might even be like just kind of me bitching about it to some people. It is something that ultimately I don't feel comfortable in the grand, at the end of the day, just playing Tower Fantasy for and supporting them, um, and so I'm just I've just decided ultimately at the end of the day to unpublish that stream on Twitch and privatize the VOD on YouTube because it just at the end of the day this was something that just did not sit right with me, and I am anticipating the whole you know why don't you just uh just accept it for what it is or why don't you just like uh not make a character this way in particular I, or I'm, I'm anticipating though i'm anticipating all these different like defenses in the grand scheme of things for tower fantasy at the end of the day i don't feel comfortable playing this game and i don't feel comfortable supporting this company and you know they might come out with an update later on down the line where it's like hey uh we heard your criticisms we heard your opinions and we've decided to ultimately change it to where this isn't a problem anymore but I mean, at the end of the day, I mean, just I, it, this doesn't sit right with me, and um, I'm just going to just not play it. I mean, you can take that as you will, but at the end of the day, that's just me. All right, so I was playing Tower Fantasy, wanting to make a new account and everything, just to sort of get over it, uh, start over and everything, and I realized something when I was making my character, and I realized that more so, I don't think that this game actually acknowledges that black people probably would play it and here's how i figure so we go to custom color four this is the color for the back of the eyes i can show it okay check this out yeah back of the eyes goes from black to saya now that's that's nothing really to write home about or anything and i mean if i was if that was the color i wanted to go for that's fine however when I go into shape, the color I have currently is about about the best I can get for like I mean black characters. Because otherwise, it's just stuff like this. Or this. I mean, yeah, sure, that's uh, that can be a tone of uh, melanin, sure. But you know what I mean. Like, for instance, if I were to just choose this color right if i was just use this skin color let me go into eyes again go back to enhanced eyes choose four this is what shows up for the back of the eyes it's just a darker color there's no like pale milky white or anything but let's say if I just wanted to make a pale skin anime character, right? Just a pale skin anime character. I go to shape. If I make a pale skin anime character, look at that. Get a close up on that. Her eyes are milky white. Now it'd be one thing if when I picked this color scheme, right? If I picked this particular skin tone, it'd be one thing if that was my choice, like the back of the eyes, if that was my choice, but it's not, it's default. I can't change it and I can't change it back to pay, pale Mickey white. Like, I don't get it. It, it just kind of makes me look my, like my character is an alien instead of like a more normal character. 
I know it's a small detail, but in the grand scheme of things, it's just like, why don't we get the choice to change it? Why don't we get the choice to edit it? Instead of just having it be a darker color of what it already is. Like, and I, I tried going through like the different other presets. I thought, oh, maybe it's like just shuffled around or something. Nope. Everything except for color four is the iris. This, back of the eyes. And I've even tried like moving it to other colors, maybe to get something else. No. Just stays on Zion, but if I upgrade the saturation, all of a sudden it's that color. Yeah. And that's fine. But when I revert to saturation, it's just back to Scion. So I don't get it. What the fuck is going on? Like, say what you will about games like Soul Calibur 6, but at the very least, when I wanted to create an alien, it let me do that because it's, it's it divides its species and races carefully and organized. This, it just doesn't make me feel like, in the grand scheme of things, like I wanted to create a character that belonged and it just didn't want me to.